All right, guys, HMP Exeter today. Uh, we're covering a story today on um, prison officer Tracy Ruby, who basically, um, she turned a blind eye to a vicious assault on an inmate. Um, I'm out today with a mobile auditor. You all right, mate? Have you got any comments to make on Tracy Ruby? Um, she got charged for misconduct in a public office. If you want any of the information, go and talk to the government. Yeah, yeah. God bless you, mate. How long have you worked here, mate? Um, is the governor around? Yeah, yeah. So yeah, we've got another abrasive uh, prison guard there. So today, guys, um, I'm out with the mobile auditor. Uh, God bless him. Uh, he's looking after me. You all right, mate? Have you got any comments to make on Tracy Ruby? Uh, she was charged for misconduct in a public office. No comments to make. You all right, buddy? We're looking for any comments on Tracy Ruby. No comments. No comments, people. No comments. We want justice. You alright? Pardon? Uh, we're covering the story on Tracy Ruby. She was charged for misconduct in a public office. Uh, she let one of. The... You just asked me a question. So she just asked me a question, yeah, and then she don't want to speak to me. You up, mate? Down there, yeah, yeah, film on the high yeah, yeah, on yeah, public yeah. highway, yeah, yeah, all right, meet a distance, on private property, yeah, yeah. So, if you listen, go, I'm a journalist, mate, and I'm looking, Doesn't, so if you're a journalist, you yeah, know yeah, the rules. yeah, this yeah, is private property, yeah, yeah, I'm asking you to leave, yeah, yeah, there. yeah, yeah. Feel for, big up, live free, it's still private property. If you want to film, you film it's, um, on the public free, highway, you've got to leave free. The it's free. private all right. property, this is, can you keep a meter distance from him just while we explain? No, off we go. This is private property. I'm What's all this commotion, guys? You want to intimidate us? Listen, um, we're not here to be intimidated. We just want to ask a civil question. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to be going, and we are going. Listen, we believe yeah that any any private land that's accessible to public becomes a public place. This is prison property. You can do everything from. So the public can't drive up here to the, to the visitor centre. It's fine to do it off the road, but on the actual up here. This is public really access. Not. If you this have legitimate business we with do. the prison, we've got le yeah. legitimate business. It's about uh, Tracy Ruby. Right. So we'll let one of the inmates get his head kicked in right. because. So you need um, to go down to the public highway. Yeah, yeah. Do whatever work anywhere. you do, do down there. Okay, that's fine. I don't need to go anywhere. This is okay. publicly accessible. Next step is oh, please. Big up, big up the mobile order. Listen, he knows his rights. He knows his rights, mate. Don't call me, mate. Listen, don't have a go at him, don't get aggressive with him, he's sat in a wheelchair, mate. All right, we're not having none of that corruption here. There's a lot of corruption in this prison regarding the inmates. Prison officers uh, letting other inmates beat up inmates. It's disgusting, it's, uh, it's not right and we're exposing it. We're making it public knowledge um, because it shouldn't be allowed to go on. People in, in, in this prison, yeah, serving a sentence and that's their punishment. The punishment is not to get a further beating from an inmate while the prison officer lets it happen. She was charged for it, misconduct in a public office. Do you condone that behaviour, officer? Do you condone that behaviour? Officer, you wanted to get a bit, you know. Officer, will you just answer that question? Do you condone that behaviour? That's why we're here. We have a press office. Yeah, yeah. We get in question. touch with press office, but they ignore us. We're down here for the people of the South West that have to come here and put up with that kind of crap. We're not having it. Yeah, all right, mate. Your superior's already spoke to us and we've already dealt with it. It's publicly accessible. Have you got any comments to make on Tracy Ruby? She allowed an inmate to attack another inmate because he was disrespectful to her. Do you condone that behaviour, officer? Do you condone it? See what I mean? That tells me that you condone it and it's not right. Why can't you just say that you don't condone it? Yeah, we'll get out of here. We have a press. Yeah, but they don't answer us, mate, and that's the issue, right? We've been. We've... Okay, we've been in touch with. It's not above your pay grade. Listen, it's about humanity, right? You know, do you condone that type of behaviour in any prison? Because it's happening in 147 prisons across the United Kingdom. And we're not having it, you know, we are, we're making a stand and things are changing now. Things are changing, prisons are changing because of us. We're not calling you all corrupt, right? I don't understand why you all take it so personally. Not all officers are corrupt, there's some brilliant prison officers. Yeah, I've got a story to cover about a prison officer who saved an inmate's life. Yeah, from hanging himself. HMP Leeds. Right, we've got a story about a prison officer at HMP Leeds, yeah, who um, testified against five officers for brutality. We're not here just to call you bad. We're here to expose the corruption and try and stop it happening. 
So we've got an ambulance coming in now, guys, yeah? Look at this, an ambulance coming in. We're not going to be getting it. Is this for another brutalised inmate? Eh? Yeah. Yeah. Is, is that ambulance for another brutalised inmate? Yeah, no So unacceptable, guys. Clean up our prison system, please. Yeah, they're getting televised, yeah? We want a clean prison system, mate. We want a clean HMP, no more corruption. No more corruption within the HMP. Yeah. Pardon, mate. Property. Stay a metre away from me, pal. Yeah, yeah. yeah. private property. Yeah, yeah. All right. Can Listen, nobody can trespass us apart from the police. Or the police will be called. You can't trespass us. The police will be called. The police can trespass us. We know our rights. We know our legal rights, that's mate. Right. Listen, have you got any comments to make on Trace Ruby? See what I mean? You won't answer and that's why we're here. You won't answer the questions, you just run away. Do you know the prison officer, Tracy Ruby? She gave the prisoner a pat on the back, yeah, for kicking him in. She opened the cell door. The other prisoner went in, kicked the shit out of him. And then Tracy Ruby gives him a pat on the back. Do you condone that behaviour is all we're asking? We're not putting you in a bad light, but by not answering that question, you're putting yourself in a bad light. Do you understand? Do you understand? You're not willing to comment, officer. You comment on my own individual behaviour. Yeah, go on then. The yeah, but you're, represent, you're representing the Crown, wearing that uniform. Yeah, so, so in our eyes... Do you, do you enjoy your job? Yes. Um, that's good. We should all enjoy our job. Listen, this isn't against you guys. This is against the corrupt ones, all right? But when we come here, when we come to prisons across the land and we get approached by prison officers, you're always abrasive with us. I can tell you want to talk. I can tell you want to talk, mate. But you know, you've got a gang around you that stops you. We understand that. The full prison service is corrupt, guys. It's fully corrupt. All right, and, and it's mainly young officers. Do you know that 33% of all prison officers have only been in the game for two years? Uh, we, we understand you get low wages, right? We understand all that and, it, and it's easy to be manipulated by criminals. But you shouldn't be taking up the job. You shouldn't be doing it because you're putting people's lives at risk. People are out there dying. People are out there committing suicide. Look at the suicide rate. You're all right hiding behind that pillar, mate. Because you're part of corruption, you, I can tell. Because you don't like what we're saying. You're very angry at what we're saying. And it's not against you as an individual officer. No, it's not. It's against the corrupt officers. So you just walk away. It's shameful. It's all we ever get. Doormen now, people. Doormen. Do you know what? We're going to go away from this anyway. We've said our piece to officers. I can tell this officer here, yeah? I can tell he's a good officer. More than likely, he's a good officer. Um, I, didn't do, I didn't do much history on this place, um, just exposed what's going on with um, Tracy Ruby and the inmate who got his uh, head kicked in. So yeah, and why I covered this story people is because, yeah, um, it happened at HMP Armley where a prison officer, female prison officer, she didn't like one of the lads, it were a black gentleman, um, and what she proceeded to do then was tell lads, uh, tell a gang of lads that he were in for a rape. So I branded him as a rapist. Uh, the lads went into his cell, kicked the shit out of him, uh, the guy ended up dying. Yeah, so there you go, that's what we've got, that's what we're up against. Uh, prison officers allowing violence on uh, vulnerable inmates, and it's not fair. It's not fair, it's absolutely, it, it is, it's shocking. Shocking to core, because do you know what, while they're in there, yeah, and yeah, granted, they have committed crimes, a lot of them should still be in there, yeah, I get that. But what they don't deserve is uh, being beaten to a pulp. Right, and it's just been allowed to happen. No more corruption, guys. Clean up our HMPs. We want a clean prison system. No more drug smuggling. No more sleeping with inmates. No more sleeping with inmates. No more drug smuggling. You will be prosecuted. You will be pursued and you will be prosecuted.